Good evening, and tonight we're going to make a spinach tart, which can either be served as an appetizer, if you have a lot of guests, or as a main dish. So I'll first give you the ingredients that we'll need. Grated Parmesan or Gruyere cheese, a little goose fat, two or three onions depending on the size, salt and pepper of course, two or three bunches of spinach, again depending on the size of your tart, gum fresh, and a ready-made pastry crust or filo dough. So, we'll start by peeling the onions. And if you cry, just keep on going. So we're going to cut them very thinly, probably using a really good knife. So again, very, very thin. And I'm using yellow onions today because they're in season and they're very good, but you can use any onions you want. Okay, and I'm al already ahead of you all. I'm cutting one now, but I have the other simmering in the pan with a little goose fat. So the spinach we'll do in another pan with again some goose fat. Okay, so unroll the pastry dough. And you can use either a flakier crust or more of a pie crust, which would be a little thicker. Uh, it depends on your taste and your choice. But just don't forget to cut the paper that hangs off. Uh, it'll burn in the oven. Okay, so press it into your pan. And we'll put the onions in the bottom. I'll go get mine that I've already simmered. Okay, here we have the brown onions. And we'll spread them all over the bottom. Next, we'll crack the eggs. Now, I suggest using three, since we also have the creme fraiche. Okay, and we'll beat the eggs. And we'll add the spinach that we've also fried slightly. Now I've used frozen spinach, so this recipe is really easy to do at the last minute. We'll add for we'll add for five to six. Uh, we'll say four to six people. Voilà. And we mix. Now 
Okay, and now two big spoonfuls of creme fraiche. Salt. Du sel. Pepper. Du poivre. And we'll mix this all well. And now to give you an idea of how to salt and pepper, I like to take a spoonful of each and sprinkle it around all over the mix in a circle. And now depending on how much you like salt and pepper, go around either once or twice with your spoon. But don't forget it's always better to put in less, you can never fix an oversalted dish. Okay, so we'll end up with our tart filling much like a thick cream. And then we'll spread this over our browned onions. And spread it around evenly. Okay, now I use grated Parmesan, but you can also use grated Gruyere. Now if you use Parmesan, use less than you would the Gruyere, it's a stronger cheese. Okay, and we've covered the top of our, of our tart. And Probably about four tablespoons maximum of Parmesan. So we'll put this in a hot oven at about 300, 325 degrees Fahrenheit and leave it for about 35 minutes. But check it every now and then to see that the crust is browning and the spinach is, is browned and cooked. So bon appétit and I'll see you in a little bit to show you the result. Okay, 35 minutes have gone by. You should have something reasonably like this. The crust is flaky and brown, and the top is browned as well. And let it cool slightly before taking it out of the dish and serving. I wish you a bon appétit. Au revoir.